Alright, what is up Transformer fans? This is the video review of Transformers Prime Beast Hunter Cyberverse Legion Class Blight, which is actually Blot from the G1 Terracons, but they call him Blight now, but we all know that Blight is a clone of Bumblebee, and that's not okay. So he's Blot. B-L-O-T. So here he is, and his, it looks like a kind of a kaiju if you've seen Pacific Rim. Um, he's really kind of big, hunched over, he's bipedal, um... He's a, there's a lot of kind of dark shiny blue and then this pastel kind of purple with the yellow painting on top. Uh, really, really looks nice. I, I really like the way he looks here. Um, he does have some posability in this bestial mode. You get a full ball joint here at the arm or shoulder, uh, kind of a rotate here at the <clears throat> elbow, and then the hands kind of open and close. And then you can also get a little bit of a range of motion here at the hip. But other than that, he just kind of hunches over. <clears throat> here he is compared next to uh, Hunger with three R's. And he um, he's pretty big compared to Hunger here. You can see he's, uh, he's really wide, but he's not tall. He's kind of squat. So <clears throat> there's that. Transformation for this guy is actually pretty simple. What you want to do first is take this headpiece and flip it all the way around to the back. And it just clicks right there. Then what you want to do is you want to lift this panel out like so. Like this. It comes out like that. Then you take the head and you flip it up. Kind of bring this back in because what you're going to do now is you're going to take this lower bit and bring these together. And you can see when you bring the, that together it kind of pushes these panels out. It's like a scissor effect. And so now you bring these, which were the hands, down, rotate them here at the knee, open the hand, or what was the hand, and now this is his feet. And then you bring what used to be the legs down, flip the hand out from right there, flip the hand out from right there, and then um, straighten him up. And here you have Blot in his robot mode, and that is just really, really neat, the transformation that he goes through, he kind of flips upside down, and then the proportions change, whereas these were more narrow, they're now more wide, it's, it's just a really neat uh, transformation he's got going on here, and the side profile is pretty cool too, because he is kind of hunched over, and he's kind of leaning in, like Hulk style, but um, there's that, he does come with an affliction hammer, which is the same daggum hammer we get with every other single person in the planet of Cyberverse. So he can hold it in his hand. So like that. Um, Posability wise, you can kind of rock his head back and forth. Um, shoulders are ball jointed. Hand is kind of ball jointed or on a swivel. Legs are ball jointed. The same same articulation as uh, before. But uh, the head is really kind of neat. If you can see that. There it is. You can see it's like kind of a sound wave with a jaw line, basically. It's a G1 sound wave with a bestial jaw. So I kind of like the way his head looks. So there's that. Then comparing him to all the other Predacons so far, here's Windraiser, or Cutthroat. Uh, Hunger, which I'll just change real quick into his robot mode. Because, you know, he's quick and easy. There's Hunger. And then finally, Center Twin on this side. So there's, so far, all the Abominus components. I still have yet to find uh, Ripper Snapper. He seems to be the hardest to find, just because I guess he's the last one. So I've been looking for him, though. I've been trying to find him. So there's that. Um, he's pretty good. I like him. I like him a lot. He has a lot of really good features in, um, in his robot mode and his beast mode and I think that the transformation is my favorite part of the whole figure. I really like the way he just kind of flips upside down and changes proportions like that. Um, it's very similar to what Cinder Twin did with his legs, how it changes proportions with just a few steps, which is really neat. Um, but I like the paintwork, I like the way he looks, He just he's really neat and he's really unique. So uh, anyway, thank you for viewing this video and goodbye.